This video series will provide an introduction to the Dolby IMS 3000 web user interface. The overview is made up of four short videos. This is the third of the four videos, which will introduce the device controller, diagnostics, and log viewer menus. From the device controller tab, the user can connect to the IMS 3000 by entering the IP address in order to adjust HDMI and HDSDI formats like scaling, color space, and gamma. The System and Info tabs provide additional information regarding the IMS 3000 that are typically not altered. The Diagnostics menu consists of four tabs which provide detailed information for the IMS 3000. The System tab allows the user to see important information about the server. Users can also download a detailed report. A detailed report contains all IMS 3000 system information, including comprehensive logs that should be provided to Dolby Cinema support when reporting an issue. Through the Status Overview tab, the user has a quick view of the device status for items such as memory, network, projector, storage, and security manager. When troubleshooting an issue, it is helpful to look here as a first indicator. Under the Storage tab, all three hard drives that make up the RAID arrays are represented here, SDA, SDB, and SDC. Two RAID arrays are managed within these three drives. Click on a hard drive to view detailed information and performance data. If a hard drive is performing poorly, it can be replaced by clicking Remove. If multiple hard drives fail or all three hard drives are being replaced, a complete reinitialization can be performed by clicking Reset All Drives. The Media Block tab shows the projector service door, marriage, lamp, and dowser status. Also shown here is the Media Block's watermark types and versioning. The Log Viewer menu consists of four tabs Last Packages Logs, Log Records, Log Download, and Notifications. The last package's logs displays the last package installation attempt, the date it was attempted, and if it was a success or failure. The Log Records tab allows access to logs, which can also be filtered to provide a subset of data on performances, maintenance, management, and health. The Log Download tab is used to create an XML log based on the Security Manager or System database. The database captures all server playback events, which the user can view for any date and time range. The Notifications tab shows all notifications the IMS 3000 has received, both read and unread. This completes Part 3 of the Dolby IMS 3000 Web UI Overview. Continue the series of videos to learn more about the Dolby IMS 3000 Web User Interface.